Well, this is uh, a stadium I'm sure you'll recognize, the Santiago Bernabeu in Madrid. And today it's Real Madrid, they will play Levante. This is the Real Madrid lineup. Thibaut Courtois starts in goal. Sergio Ramos plays with Rafael Varane in central defence. Isco plays with Luka Modric in the centre of the park. Karim Benzema is the lone striker today. Let's take a look at the Levante lineup. 4-3-3. And they've got natural wide players in that front three with a central striker. I think that's the key because those lads on the flanks, it's quite a complicated job actually because they've got to come inside, support the centre forward and they've also got to funnel back when they haven't got the ball. So an onus on... Relatively new, the Santiago Bernabeu Stadium, in the sense that it was opened after the Second World War, 1947, and then they had floodlights put in in 1957. Everybody knows about the history since then. It's been Real Madrid writing new chapters pretty much every campaign. A wonderful football club. Yeah, and it's uh, a more than pleasant stadium to come and visit for the supporters. They've got heaters all over the shop to keep you warm at night. They seem to have moved on a little bit, Real Madrid, from just signing the best players in the world and having that Galactico philosophy. They do get the best players in the world, but there's more of a the right wish, really, to get them to operate as a team rather than a collection of individuals. Yeah, you wonder if they've been influenced a little bit by Barcelona's approach, that team ethic more than the Galactico approach. Benzema trying to get behind the defenders to get in a good cross. Can he pick somebody out with this pullback? Isco can put them in front here. That did look like a real opening, but they've dealt with it. Bale. Hazard. Excellent piece of defensive play under some pressure, I must say. Real Madrid strong favourites. As they are quite often. They've had to learn to live with it, and usually they've done it well. Wasteful pass, unforced error, really. They spread it out wide here. Chance to get some width into this attack. To put them in front. Truly outstanding save. No wonder he's getting a standing ovation for that. Corner for Real Madrid. Well, here comes the corner. Cleared away by the defender. And here is Rodriguez. Benzema. Wonderful interception. Well, he has cleared the danger. Here's Isco. The game being played in one half of the pitch at the moment. The team with possession finding it hard, though, to get into areas where they're going to score a good... Guiding it through. Azar. Good width in the attack here, looking for a cross at the end of it. That danger was looming large, but they've got themselves back on the ball. It's Isco. Modric. That's good support play from his teammates. Kamaha. Real chance for Gareth Bale, certainly by his standards, for the first goal of the game. Really should have been the opener for his team. Work by the goalkeeper. The ball is his, and he's made sure he's protected it. Karim Benzema. Gareth Bale's often used the wide areas to great effect. 
looking for an opening with some good control build-up. Benzema. Pedro Lopez. They could have got through there, but the defender was absolutely on top of his game. Benzema must take the lead here, which they do in good style. Who adds a scoring touch to his wonderful array of midfield skills. Well, he gets the credit, and the credit was being in the right place at the right time. Yeah, I think the easiest goal he will score this entire season. It was almost an air of, well, we expected this when the goal was celebrated, nothing too extravagant. I think they know they're the better side and they expect to win. No, I think they do. There's a certain swagger to their play uh, and inner self-belief. They know they're better and they're showing out on that pitch. No great shocks on the cards then because it's Real Madrid who lead. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Ball in behind from Azza. Benzema. Oh, too early, offside. Well, half-time not that far away and Real Madrid with an eye on it maybe with this lead. Yeah, I think they'll be fairly confident that they can see it through. Karim Benzema, Carvajal, Isco, great ball, Azza. Looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. Here's Isco, Modric, now James Rodriguez. Real Madrid, who are it steered through off his line quickly. The keeper to get that had to be. And the players face another two minutes added on by the referee. It's an excellent cross, and they get it away. Campania could score, and that's easy for Courtois. And that's half time. Signaled by the referee. 1 0 the half time score. Well, the player that we're featuring here has done well. He's certainly been an influence on this first half. Yeah, I thought he looked lively in that first half. Really sharp and obviously got the goal. Another 45 of that, and he'll be well pleased. Settling back down here in the Santiago Bernabeu Stadium. Modric. Here's Isco. Marcelo. Eden Hazard. It's unlike him, really, to play the ball straight to the opposition. Lovely, incisive pass. Looks the goalkeeper in the eye. He's blocked the shot well. They set it up well for the cross. Gareth Bale. Bale. Benzema. It's Isco. Marcelo. Just a case of finding the spare man is always available in their own half and the opposition letting them do this at the moment, although they are trailing. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Gareth Bale. Carvajal, Benzema, working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. Made sure the pass wasn't completed. He has cleared it well. Borja Mayoral, guiding the pass through. Going forward well. He's one-on-one -on -one with the goalkeeper. Sergio Ramos clears it here. Karim Benzema decided to go infield, looking dangerous. 
Modric, Isco, Azar, Benzema, Rodriguez, Ames Rodriguez, who adds a scoring touch to his wonderful array of midfield skills. Well, he gets the credit, and the credit was being in the right place at the right time. Yeah, I think the easiest goal he will score this entire season. Restarting at 2 0. Campania. Manager thinking for the away side, time for a change. Attacking well here. Trying to turn over the play here. Gareth Bale. Hamis Rodriguez. Really just lending the ball to his teammates. Yeah, one of those days where he's always available and he's pulling all the strings out there. Morales. These two have got a great understanding with their passing. Real promise about that build-up until that challenge. Carvajal. Rodriguez. Modric. Tony Kroos. It's in the DNA of Real Madrid to try and improve the margins here, but they can't play high-risk football in these circumstances. Yeah, they've been in a really tough game today. Take... Bale! Bale! Saw the goal and went for it. Who adds a scoring touch to his wonderful array of midfield skills. Well, he gets the credit, and the credit was being in the right place at the right time. Yeah, I think the easiest goal he will score this entire season. I have to say, it's so one-sided today, but all credit to the team that are racking up the goals. Morales. Bale. Ten minutes left of regular time. Rochina. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Proper tackle, that. Bale. Now, can he take them on? Hamis Rodriguez, Tony Kroos, Eden Hazard. It's a goal! Who adds a scoring touch to his wonderful array of midfield skills. Well, he gets the credit, and the credit was being in the right place at the right time. Yeah, I think the easiest goal he will score this entire season. Fullback who's going to be replaced. A very fine fullback indeed. Yeah, he's dependable, he's reliable, and he's got a little bit of style and flair to him as well when he goes forward. There's no doubt that the scoreline reflects realistically the nature of the game. There's nothing false about it. They've thoroughly deserved to be so far ahead. Nothing so far in this game to surprise us. Perhaps only the, the margin that they lead by. Yeah, it's not always easy coming into a game and everyone's expecting you to get a hat full, but they've kept their focus this side and uh, taken the chances nicely when they've cropped up. Real Madrid have the ball. And that's the referee's decision. Two added minutes. But we're down to the last minute here. Guiding it through. Azar. Marcelo. Here's a chance for Real Madrid. The shot's on. And he scored for Real Madrid. Who adds a scoring touch to his wonderful array of midfield skills. Well, he gets the credit, and the credit 
was being in the right place at the right time. Yeah, I think the easiest goal he will score this entire season. Well, it's great when a plan comes together and the manager doubly delighted with the way his team are playing. It is now an extraordinary lead and you could say really game over. And that is the final whistle here. Real Madrid have victory today. Well, it turned out to be a different kind of game to the one perhaps we set up for you at the beginning. Very one-sided. Yeah, you end up feeling a bit disappointed as a neutral because we didn't really get a contest, but the winning team won't be disappointed at all. Played well. well let's talk a word or two about James Rodriguez at the final whistle, Alan. What do you think he, he did well and maybe not so well today? So often we think of his creative abilities, that knack of picking out a pass, but today it was all about his finishing. A really good couple of goals in this team win.